And the amazing thing that I've experienced is that my life makes positively no sense whatsoever unless I look at it from the viewpoint that Allah had a plan from the very start. There's absolutely no way that my life and all of the puzzle pieces, this huge puzzle that fit together, make a remarkable picture. I would never have known while I was living this life what the plan was at the end of the road. And now I realize with absolute certainty that there is no other answer than Allah had a plan from the start. I want those of you who are not Muslims to understand that when we say Allah, we mean nothing different than when you say God. It is exactly the same thing. When we talk about the Prophet Muhammad, we love him and respect him as a very remarkable prophet. But I want you to understand we also love and respect Jesus as a very remarkable prophet. And we love and respect Abraham and Moses and all of the excellent Jewish prophets because they are also our prophets. We consider that they are all Muslims. Because the word Muslim, it's an Arabic word, it just means a believer. Thank you, sister. And a believer in any language is still a believer. Those of you who are Jewish, those of you who are Christian, and think that we are something different than you, think again. Because before there were words, before there were Christians and Jews and Buddhists and Hindus and Mormons and Seventh-day Adventists, before we took on names of Protestants and Lutherans and Scientologists and all the myriad numbers of religions that we call ourselves by, we were first and foremost one soul, one spirit created by the same God. And before we had these words to come between us and these words to possibly misunderstand, we were one and God is one. And that's the main and foremost message of Islam, that God is one. When you look on the flag of Islam, and also the flag of the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia, you will see some Arabic words. It's a saying, it says, La ilaha illallah Muhammad Rasulullah. And that means only God is God, and Muhammad is prophet of God. This does not discount any of the other prophets, we accept them all, and we love them all, and we respect them all, and therefore we accept you, and we love you, and we accept you, and we respect you, and we want you to understand and accept us, because we are the same. We are one.